What's up guys, Ana is Lumi here today and I have a sweet little deck feature for you viewing pleasure. I got second place at our finals, in the finals at our Digimon local tournament, um, playing a low flute and Devi combo. So we're going to go over my deck and we'll start with the aid. We have uh, four Demi Marimon, just really good about filtering through the deck. You want to be able to draw through your deck as fast as possible, so it's just really fantastic in that set. sense. I do apologize for the background noise here at my local game shop, so one Zalmon. Zalmon, that retaliation really does come up. You have control 10 or more cards in your trash to your Digimon Games retaliation. So, fantastic, fantastic card. Or Gabumon. Gabumon, same thing, uh, just that draw two trash. Uh, one is just absolutely fantastic in the sense that you can just burn through your deck super fast to be able to draw to the piece that we need. So, four of that babe. Uh, um, two Gilmon, probably the second best rookie money deck I, I think. Uh, just really good combos with uh, the Foreground Mon, with both Millennium Mon and Chaos Gallant Mon to gain that extra memory, and then being able to just pretty much step back in is super good. Uh, two more rookies, um, we got Demi Debbie Mon. You want to max out uh, a good portion of your Debbie Mons anyways. So running this is not bad, and that two cost Milla and being a three thousand really matters, especially like Lord Nightmon where he like pick Mons off your dudes. Um, it's fantastic when they can't pick off your rookies. So one Tapiriamon, one Gazimon, one Labramon. Um, the Tapiramon and the Labramon are both for just draw effects pretty much, and the Gazimon is just a tech against most decks that gain too much memory. So it's just fantastic in my opinion. And then, you know, the spice of the deck, obviously. Uh, three Demi Debimon. Um, I don't have a fourth. I don't know if I'd run for. Um, there has been situ there were situations where I was like, I don't know entirely if I want this card at the moment, but it wasn't the worst thing. And the nice thing about Dead Debbie is he is quite literally a discard engine, so it's super nice. Alright. And we got four Debimon, the retaliation ability and the retaliation on the uh, inheritable. So when this delete uh, when this battles a Digimon, it deletes the Digimon that it was battling. And then we have three Debimon blocker, sorry, four Debimon blocker. Uh, you know, one cost the dilution blocker counts as a Debbie name. It's just really fantastic because you are running the Debbie nope. engine. So and then three Vilemon. Um, I run Vilemon as a three of. I want to run the unit as a four of because there's times like even going second, I like to leave my opponent at one versus like leaving them at two. Um, also, the or yeah, leaving them yeah at two because you'll go Digimon one or even into three, which is honestly I like this more. Um, that six thousand DP really comes up. You dodge Lord Nightmon slash uh, like Lord Nightmon swinging into your Nightmon, and Nightmon uh, can't really delete it, so they have to literally like double pick plus uh, Nightmon to kill your blocker. It's just really fantastic and really comes up. It also dodges Nidhogg and the. Um, doesn't dodge Ultra S. Ultra S literally do the Ultra S. So. But fantastic. Um, go to the ultimates. We have three War Gromon. Uh, Digiverse three. You usually get your Gilmon off of this, but there, you honestly can get your Dan, your Demi Debimon back and just set it up for you know a swing um, and then get your Dan Debbie from your deck. Because of that, when this attacking once per turn, you may uh, unsuspend this Digimon by deleting one of your Digimon. It's just, it's really good. Comes up and came up against Sam actually when I swung twice in one turn. It's beautiful. Uh, three Lady Devimon. Uh, just again, you want to draw through your deck as fast as possible to get to your combo pieces. And this comes up too. Um, when you play one of your options, you can delete one of your opponent's level threes. I've literally played my uh, zero cost option just to kill off one of my opponent's level threes before. When her underneath and it just never feels bad. Uh, two Chimeramon, honestly, just really fantastic to go into the works with this and also not really bad on, on play. It's just it's a great on play for seven, not gonna complain. Your opponent's at three, like gonna go three anyways, you're at four memory, you're gonna give them three, just trash it, trash their. The Megas, we got two Lilithmon. 
it, it, like you know between so I, I little bloop obviously this first. is the like, potential combo this is how you get into the combo but you don't feel bad going into other megas as much either little bump sucks in the, in the early game you definitely want to play her in the late game because she's going to grab your options and let you go full combo um but it's not the worst thing in the world to digivolve her early game because you can always just uh, add back that on these words so add back off on these words uh one chaos gallimon um i run one because I, I felt 2 just doesn't feel right in this deck. It's more of a like toolbox deck in my opinion. Um, but the Chaos Gallimon, same feel, similar effect to uh, Chimeramon, being able to delete one of your Digimon, delete one of your opponent's level 5 or lower. <laughs> and then your, your turn once per turn, you can, uh, when one of your Digimon is deleted, you can play a level 3 from your trash without paying its memory cost. One plays don't activate, obviously. Uh, one Tactimon, <laughs> like its name, it is a tactic card. It is fantastic. This thing comes up against like Rookie Rush. It comes up against, um, you know, you need to get the swings into the securities with the Black War Gramon underneath, or like trigger it off your Demi Demi Mon. Uh, yeah, your Demi Demi Mon. Demi Demi Mon. It was just honestly fantastic. That was one of the best combos um, of the night, honestly. And then two Dan Devies. Um, I I don't mind seeing it too. But I did one game draw both of them, and it was honestly like felt really bad. A drawing one's not bad, and it's definitely one of those cards that you just kind of like use as a trash um, option, and then being able to you know cheat it in later. Um, I don't know, uh, but this every time I drop this card, this literally won me the game. So um, against an Impel Drummond player, they swung into my security, and I was like, all right, trash your security, and oh no, I blocked with a demi. No. No, yeah, no, I did block. Um, yeah, so I I blocked with the first one, put the da Don uh, Demi Devimon into the trash, played a Dan Devi on my opponent's turn because of the Ontolution effect, and then um, my opponent swung again and then trashed him and uh, security, and he only had two left and I had three attackers, so it was just game after that. And then we'll get into the ultimates, uh, sorry, the supers, we have Omniswort, Omniswort, trash three uh, cards off the top of your deck and then play two level cape, eight costs or less, and then when attacking, add back a level one, um, sorry, level six uh, Digimon from, your, from him to your hand. To be able to delete when your opponent's unsuspended Digimon with a 12 play cost of 12 or less. Card's just fantastic, gets through blockers. And like, honestly, it, it's such a tempo move. It's like similar to the Pied move when you used to play in 1.0, where you would just drop a Pied Mon and just win next turn. It was just pure insanity, and this card is just so fantastic. Um, remember that trigger, though, for sure, because, like, I, like, I get so into the game that I look at it and I'm like, okay, that's a threat. I need to get rid of the threat that I completely forgot one digital in effect, so. Um, triggers. Uh, then we'll get into Tamers. We have Tai Kamiya. Uh, just that plus two uh, memory and then swing uh, security attack plus one because, you know, your top end is Omni. And then one Takumi Aiba. Takumi Aiba being able to just filter through your deck faster. And Manashita. Um, uh, three jack raid, <laughs> really fun. It hit this twice in security, and it was just the best feeling ever. Um, but game one memory for each ten cards in your trash. Uh, with Lilith, it gets really stupid because you gain three memory the first time, and then one after, so you end up with four memory the turn that you play Lilith, and this is in your trash, which is fantastic. And then Mega Digimon Fusion, because it literally cheats out level seven. So honestly, fantastic. The only thing I really change about this is. Probably one of those less, and then I would probably. You can't pay the records only to cast spells. I honestly, I think that's it. I think I would take one Dan Devi out for a different like toolbox um, card, maybe a Nubismon or something like that. Um, I really did like being able to see one of each if I needed it in certain situations. Like, like honestly, I just honestly wouldn't change a whole lot about this deck. It honestly played fantastic. It did break in the finals, unfortunately, but you know that's just the game of Digimon and what we play. So yeah, guys, that was my deck profile. If you guys know anyone who likes TCGs, tell them to head on my channel. Give the video a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Odd eyes, me.